Welcome back. I'm Diamond Dixon with a look at your full forecast this evening. Well, Snoopy's Pier was pretty lively just a little bit earlier, but now it's kind of cleared up just a bit. We had a nice day today. We were pretty warm. We were in the mid 90s for most of our day and our feel like temperatures were definitely in the triple digits today. We were also under a heat advisory until about 6 p.m. where those feel like temperatures were about 110 degrees. So looking at our current temperatures and feel likes. Well, we're at 86 in Port Aransas as well as Rockport, 87 in Corpus Christi, 84 in Robstown, 82 in Mathis. But those feel like temperatures right now have calmed down quite a bit. But for some of our areas, you can see right here that we are still in the triple digits for our feel like temperatures. So it's still going to feel pretty hot outside and muggy. Now our winds right now are coming from the east southeast, 21 miles per hour at the Naval Air Station, 17 at Port Aransas, as well as Rockport 16 at Corpus Christi. Those winds will kind of die off just a little bit going into our evening hours and our current dew point. Well, we're pretty oppressive. Like I said, we're sitting in the upper 70s up to the 80s for our mugginess right now. So it's the air that you can definitely wear. So you'll probably feel that. Well, that's all to say that we're going to get some rain. Well, that rain's going to be mainly Sunday morning and it's a 30% chance and we'll see those showers and thunderstorms roll through after 10 a.m. But nothing too heavy, just a little bit of showers to give us, you know, that rain that we need out here in the coastal bend. In future tracker, you'll see here our clouds covering most of our, our coastal bend there. And then we'll see that rain move through the coastal bend and then it's out the way by evening hours into the nighttime before we head into Monday. Well, this is the big question that you might have. You're like, Diamond, what's going on in the tropics? What's the latest? Well, right here behind me is Hurricane Barrel. Well, this became a hurricane today, Category 1. This is in the Atlantic, making its way towards the Caribbean. Right now, there's no threat to Texas, but we still keep an eye on everything that's happening in the tropics anyway. Now, moving a little bit closer to us here, we can see this is a tropical disturbance that wants to become more. The National Hurricane Center is expecting this to develop by 50% in the next 48 hours. Once again, that's not an issue for us right now that's in the Bay of Campeche. So we're OK. We're in the clear for Texas. Well, what is coming our way, though, is that Saharan dust. You see it's going to make its way across to Texas along the coast there and we'll feel those effects. Now, what that looks like for us here in the coastal bend, what you might notice are some really nice sunsets and sunrises. You might feel some respiratory illnesses, you know, if you are maybe a little bit allergic to dust and it's supposed to limit our tropical activity, although it's kind of a brewing out there in the tropics. We got a lot of action going on. If you do so happen to see a wonderful sunset or sunrise, we'd love for you to post it in our Coastal Bend Weather Watchers group on Facebook and you could be part of our newscast. That'd be really nice. Well, looking ahead at our seven day, like I mentioned, we have that rain coming through Sunday, 30% chance those showers are going to happen a little bit after 10 a.m. For the rest of your work week, we're in the upper 90s with the lows in the in the 80s. So I hope you have a great rest of your weekend. Stay cool and hydrated.